What's up everybody, Soldier First Class here bringing you another video, and this time we've got a tutorial on how to complete the Chocobo race in the Comlands. Now what you want to do is the majority of the balloons you want to get at the beginning of this race are on this ramp. If you can get at least three to four, that's a good happy medium. What you want to do also is stay to the right in the first half of the race. Once the first wave of birds goes past you, you want to move to the middle, pick up as many balloons as you can, and immediately go right when you see birds spawn. Now around this corner here, where it transitions, you will never get hit by a bird. It looks close, but the spawn time for the birds isn't proper enough for the bird to actually hit you. And what you want to do in the second half of the race is stay to the left. And you also want to go down the little dip there at the end, because the birds don't spawn properly until they hit the lane. So going down that little lip will help you avoid another bird at the end of the race that could possibly derail your time. Now. There are some exaggerated movements with the Chocobo that can cause you to lose this race. And to avoid such a move, what you want to do is when you go completely to the right or the left in which part of the race you're in, you don't want to exaggerate your movement toward the left or right. You want to gradually move over. And what I also recommend is using the D-pad. But what you want to do is you want to gradually move over. The birds won't just sharp 90 degree turn and hit you. They are still programmed to be on basically a rail, and they will come at you. They'll deviate from their path a little bit, but they won't come at you at a 90 degree weird angle. So, as you'll see, some of the birds tail off trying to get you on the edge, but they can't because the chocobo's movements don't allow it to. So, like I said, around this corner right here where it transitions to the next part of the race, I have never gotten hit in the entire time I've been doing this race. So that's a little bit of a tip I can give you to avoid getting hit. You'll notice also, like I said, the birds don't spawn properly until after that lane is filled. So what you want to do is go down that little dip. And you also, another tip here is that you want to finish the race under 36 seconds. 12 balloons is the sweet spot. If you can get under 36 seconds, you will hit this sun sigil every time. You notice I have a time of 0.0.0. .0 .0. And that is enough to get you the Sun Sigil. You also kind of want to try to get a time less than that. Which it doesn't register that time. But it the game is programmed to give you the Sun Sigil for beating 0, 0.0.0. .0, not for just obtaining it. So if you hit 36 balloons, or 36 seconds, and you get 12 balloons, you're just at 0.0.0. .0. .0. So what you want to do is get 13 balloons or get under 36 seconds with 12 balloons. But anyway guys, that's about all I can give you for this race. It seems like it's a very, it is a difficult race, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to say that this is the perfect fix, but this will definitely help you in your quest to get this Sun Sigil for Titus Scalable. Because this race, while it is difficult, can easily be tricked into doing it the way you want it. So I thought I would provide this today. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, subscribe for more content. If you like this tutorial, there'll be plenty more on Final Fantasy X and probably the other Final Fantasy games in the series. Comment on the video. Tell me, you know, did you rage? How many controllers have you broken during this this race? You know, this race has been out since 2001 and it's literally not changed, and it's still super rage-inducing. Which, actually, I have a little bit of a surprise for you guys. I will actually show you a clip from the old video, which is my rage at the end of my, or while I was doing this on stream a long time ago. And you're not going to want to miss it. So, thank you for watching. This is Soldier First Class, and I'm signing out. Good luck, guys.